out here, bro. It's also like podcast. This is a to get our content out right, staying consistent with Mondays. So if you're listening to this wherever you're at, driving, at home, at night, in bed, whatever it is, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Honestly, this is a, one of those where it's kind of a thank you guys, man, a kind of self reflection of, you know, people have asked, like, yo, we've been, it's been a long journey. 2022 has been our journey for being in LA now a little a year and a month now and as much as you want to get quality content sometimes the content just has to happen where right now we're sitting outside the balcony of the hotel we stayed in here in San Diego after the toy drive you know there's cars driving there's air conditioning on the outside over here um this video this this podcast this episode is more of a Realize it now and then later. Realize how special you are and how talented you are in whatever area you're trying to achieve in and stop doubting yourself. You know, we're gonna, I'm going to take it back to 2021 where we had no idea what was going to happen if we took a chance coming to the LA. And then coming to LA and going through a lot of days where, man, am I doing enough? Is this going to work out? Is this working? And we're here sitting now, December, a couple, couple days, couple weeks before the new year. And I can honestly say it has. And what we tend to do ourselves is, is self-sabotage ourselves, right? It, it's not going to work out. Well, well, if I do this, you know what? I might, it may not work out, so why waste my time? No, that's exactly what you got to do. You have to make time. And if you were to lose in whatever area not succeed in that, not succeed in whatever you're doing, bro, at least you tried. At least you have a story to tell, an experience to tell, a learning experience. To If you were to try again, now you know what not to do, right? Instead of being that one person that's always been, well, I could have done it. Maybe it would have worked out, right? Like, we got to stop doing that. We have to. Stop putting ourselves in that little box of life and be like, well, my little box of dreams is going to stay right there because they're way too hard and unattainable right now. But in reality, they're always going to be unattainable if you never actually open the box and go after them, right? And a lot of this has to do with friends, the people you are surrounded with, right? It, if you're around successful people, you'll be, you'll be successful if you want to be, Right? So there's been people that have a lot of successful people around them, people that are actually doing something, and because they're not ready in life yet, they don't take advantage. They don't feel motivated. You know, the people that we've been around, thankfully, blessedly, and they motivate us to the, to the fullest. I want to bring something to the table. I want to, offer, I want to offer something, not just knowledge, not just money, you know, my experience. You know, this is what I've been doing. This will work. How can we grow together? And a lot of people, man, whether it's your relationship, whether it's your friends, your family, those relationships, we are so easily convinced that it's not for us. We're so easily convinced by other people that our dream is not going to work out, that our vision is not going to work out because it is unattainable to everybody. I'm here sitting in sunny San Diego telling you yes it, it's all possible bro we i've been through my own path i've been through my own journey of self-doubt and everything but the one thing that never changed throughout this 2021 to 2022 is i've never gave up never so i don't know what you're doing right now while you're listening to this i don't know what dreams you have in in mind and in your head and in your heart that you want to set out to do in 2023, you got to go and do it. And not just waiting for the New Year's resolution, right? Well, 2023 is my year, but then you have no action behind it. No, go out and get it. Go out and get it. If you're listening to this on a Monday, Monday morning, know whatever you want to do, you have to start now. Plan for it right now, as soon as you're done listening to this, and work towards it. It's not, it's not going to be easy, man. That's the thing we're not going to betray. You know, you're going to set out to do something. You're going to be successful in the, wet, in the within the first month. No, no, no. 
most likely that's going to be the case. It's not. You may get lucky, but there's no such thing as luck when you know you're putting in the work. So maybe this month was good, and maybe next month it doesn't do, it doesn't move the your your bar. It doesn't. And those are the days, those are the months where you gotta, I gotta push, I gotta keep going, I gotta keep driving, I gotta keep moving forward. Because you have no idea that maybe that this month you didn't pop off, maybe this month you didn't get the sales, maybe in this month your relationship, your whatever didn't work. Oh, but if you keep working at something, there's no way in the world that's not going to work out but it's going to work out for the best there to my next point there's things that are out of our control out of our control there's things that are in this world that are going to happen that probably happened to you in 2020 and throughout this year things happen to you throughout this year for a reason and that's for you to grow through it or from it it wasn't in your path just for like for whatever reason because they want to punish you it's in your path for a reason. You got to grow. In this world, in this life, you have to grow as a person. And there's going to be a lot of moments, right, where you're just doubting yourself. You're feeling lonely, sad, unhappy. Whatever those emotions are, embrace them. Find the source. Why do you feel like this? Man, I'm tired, bro. Why? I'm just unhappy. Why? Why? Give yourself that answer. I'm telling you, man, we're, we're outside in, we're outside right now in San Diego, so obviously you're hitting the bus. That's a fire truck, actually. Um, yeah, but give yourself that answer and do yourself that justice. Why are you unhappy right now in your life? Why, why wasn't this your year as you anticipated? Right? It's, it's everybody's question to themselves, why me? Why wasn't I chosen? Why didn't I get lucky? Sometimes you don't. Sometimes it's not for you. And the things that are not for you were never going to be meant for you. That's the thing, right? Your girlfriend, your boyfriend left you. The relationship didn't work. You didn't get the promotion you, you wanted. You didn't get this, this, this. But well, if it's in your control, change it. And if you, you cannot control it, then move on. You gotta know. You gotta know when to, when to let go and when to move on. You have to. Sticking to something and hanging on to it for the dear life when you know it's not gonna move nowhere. It's not going anywhere. You're getting the same outcome every single time. Man, you're you're gonna you're gonna lose, and not lose in whatever that area is. You're gonna lose yourself. The reason why I wanted to do this this, uh, this podcast, man, this episode, right, it wasn't just for the consistency, right? The biggest thing in, in your area of work, you got to be consistent. Maybe you're not motivated, but you got to be consistent, right? Your consistency will keep you motivated, and you'll find that. But it was for to give you guys that testimony, man, that anything is possible. Anything you want to do, anything in your life, anything in in your power, in your hands, is possible. You want to do social media? Cool. You want to open up a business of clothing? Cool. You want to create a brand? You want to do cut lawns and, and do dry, whatever it is. It is possible. That's the thing, bro. Anything is possible if you set your mind out to it. If you put your heart into it, if you put your soul into it, and you cradle that baby and you, and you caress the baby, that's you. That business, that idea, that dream that you're having, that is your baby. That is your... You got to hug it, bro. So if you're hearing this, watching this, whatever whatever is easier, thank you guys for tuning in, right? There's a lot of noise happening outside. Um, but this is your wake-up call. Why not you and why not now? Why wait till later? Why wait until the perfect moment? Why wait when you have the best? Op- no, it's right now. You are who you are. Be confident in that. Be yourself. And, and, and don't worry about the outside noise, man. They don't like what you do. Oh, so be it. That's them. They don't want to support you. It's okay. They don't have to. They don't want to show you love and whatever. You, they don't have to. Nobody has to do anything for you. But you have to do it for yourself. Trust me. Trust me. Trust me. People are going to come in and out of your life for whatever the case is to teach you a lesson 
to show you love or to just come show you come show you a part of your moment be there at, at be there at that moment in your life where you need that person sometimes they don't they don't stay forever but as chris has said lose a person don't lose a lesson lose the person don't lose the lesson there's a lot of people that come into our lives and we don't understand why they leave us we don't understand why they didn't stay but then you analyze maybe that time wasn't their time maybe at that moment in your both of both lives it wasn't the perfect time for each other so be a good luck to them good luck to them for for a long time man i i, I was being i was moving with hatred i was i'm petty i know this and someone did something to me and i i'm like bro why and just i held that grudge and then i learned how to lead with love move with love hey i know you did this to me yo just good luck I got to I got to make sure that type of hatred and energy in my life I got to get rid of it. I got to get rid of it. So I'll tell you right now, holding that type of of energy, that type of emotion in bottled up in you, it's not it, bro. It is not it. So you you got to make sure you leave with the right foot. Lead with love. Lead with love. Learn how to let go, learn how to move on, learn how to forgive not for them but for you. And man, enjoy life. Lose a person, never lose a lesson. There is things that um There's moments this whole year, man, how everything's been going that I wish some people were here. Man. I would I wish they would have seen this. And um, damn, you know, yeah, you, you when you're talking one on one on the camera, it's kind of like you're talking to yourself. So, you know, there, there's one thing in the bottom of my mind is there's some people that that did have to leave. Power above, just needing them a lot sooner than, than anticipated, and uh, I wish they would have seen this now. How far this came, you know. So, uh, but hopefully, made you guys proud, right? All you can do is is move with love. All you can do is put your best foot forward, and hope to one day make the people that you love the most and love you the most proud. Trust me, they're always gonna be so proud of you, no matter if it fails or succeeds. They just need you, want you to be okay. I, man, I slept on myself way too much, man. I died on myself way too long and wait and too many years, too many times for I don't know what reason. Trying to follow other people, trying to make other people happy, trying to please them instead of pleasing myself, making myself happy. But you know what? It's time. It's time to choose you. It's time to be you. It, you're not always going to make everybody happy, but you got to make you happy. And that's the most important thing in this world, in, in this life. Make yourself happy, and then other people will attract. And if the people around you are not happy, yo, sometimes you got to move on. You got to lose some people. got to not lose the lesson. And you got to make sure you always lead with love. Always lead with positivity. Always lead with that energy and, and that charisma that brightens other people's days. Because you never know what other people go through. So... This is going to be a, a, a quick a quick pod, quick podcast, quick episode. So if you take anything from this, just know, just know that there is a truck behind. Just know you have to stop doubting yourself. Stop waiting for the perfect moment. There's not going to be a perfect moment. The perfect moment is right now. There's no better time than now. Stop thinking about the past. You are not your past. You are not what happened to you. You are not that person anymore. And don't worry about the future. Worry about the now. Be present in the now. Work towards. If you work right now, the future is going to be promising. You know what's going to happen if you do this. You know your outcome 
if you do this right now, you know that outcome at the end of the tunnel. So focus on the now. Be you right now. Do what you have to do right now. And stop thinking about the past. Don't let the past determine your present. And don't let the present ruin your future. Don't let the past determine your now. And don't let the now ruin your future. Damn, that was good. I got to admit. But, yeah, don't get stuck there, bro. The past is the past. The old you is the old you. What happened back then happened back then. You are not that. You are not that person. So make sure you leave with love. You stay positive. And we'll catch you a week before the new year, man. But you guys have a good rest of your day. Good good morning. We are beyond thankful, beyond appreciative of what you do and, and what you guys have done for us this, this whole time. So make sure you subscribe. You send love. Shout out my boy, Baseball MX for this Jalisco shirt jersey. Man, let's run it, bro. Make sure we're going to go have a good time. We're going to go eat with everybody. But when I say there's no, this is just a proven fact. There's no, there's no better time than now. Recording right now outside in the balcony in sunny San Diego. And we got to get this content out. We got to get this message out. Because something told me, yo, we got to do this. Got to make sure that people people hear this message. Because you never know when someone needs it. And that's what we're doing. That's what I'm doing. It's a Dusko on the mic. Appreciate it all y'all. Let's go. Let's go.